Aloha and good morning guys, Lee Theme Park Ohana here. I'm at Disney's Pop Century. Now recently I started a Facebook page, uh, Disney's Pop Century Tips and Tricks. It's gotten very popular and I've gotten a lot of requests about the food court. So today I'm gonna to do a food court video of um, breakfast and then lunch. So follow the adventure. Stay tuned to the end of the video for a very special offer. So as I walk into the lobby, I see that they have some Encanto-inspired dishes. It's, it's a, a signature chef, Chef Louie. She has her version of Eras and Mampostiao. I totally butchered that. But it is a crispy pork carnita served with Spanish style rice and beans, pickled onions, and a crispy plantain. It looks really good. So if I'm around for lunch and they're serving that at lunch, I'm trying that. But it could be a dinner item too, I'm not sure. They also have a Mirabelle inspired cupcake. Cinnamon cupcake filled with custard on top of coconut buttercream. Toasted coconut and Mirabelle inspired fondant garnish. That is very cool. So if you've ever stayed at Pop Century or any of the uh, value resorts, they don't have specific dining options. It's just a big food court. And you'll notice like at the, the rest of the hotels like uh, Polynesian or Contemporary, their um, quick services are much smaller because they have sit down dining options. But here at the value resorts, they have a, just a big cafeteria with a lot of different um, value food. So we'll check out breakfast and then we'll come back for lunch. So before we get into the food options, I'll just show you some of the sitting and dining areas. As soon as you come into the left through the gift shop, there's a quiet little dining area. There's a TV over here if you want to sit and watch a movie. There right now they're playing Frozen. And then there, it runs the whole length of the back of the building is the big dining area back here as well, as you can see. And in the middle, you got your, your fountain service. I'll just show you the length of the actual food court. Right at the end of the registers is where you get your utensils and napkins. And you'll see there's another seating dining area over here on the far left where Frozen is also playing. Or you can sit outside, I'll show you that real fast. And you'll see there's a dining area outside if you wish to eat outside. It looks like there's about eight to tables. The hours here, it's on the other side of the wall. Here. I'll just come back in through the door. Hey, shirt and shoes are required. See, so you're at the pool, you gotta put a shirt on to come in here. But the um, food court is open from 7 a.m. to 11 p.m. daily. So for breakfast, I will start left to right. Now, at the base of the registers, I have little grabbing goes different snacks like breakfast bars, you can get Rice Krispie treats, chips, different bottled sodas and drinks. But over here you got your mobile order pickup. They, they suggest that you do the mobile order, that way you can just order your food on your way up here, grab it, then go sit down and eat. But you can go in line and order food. So here at the first station, from left to right, they have a waffle bounty platter. Uh, Mickey shaped waffles, plant based character waffles. And then they have um, for kids' meals, they got scrambled eggs, Mickey waffles. It looks like they got a blueberry muffin, coffee cake, Blue coffee cake and blueberry muffin in the grab and go. I'll show you that in a minute here. They also have sides of bacon, sausage, and potato barrels. In the middle of the food court is where they have the grab and goes. So they got water here. Beer, soda, Powerades. Oh wow, they have deli pickles. That's kind of cool. They have Baby Bell cheese, 
hard boiled eggs, apple slices, uncrustables. Those usually come with kids' meals. They have apple juice, yogurt, different milks, and they have salad. Oh, Jen, they have Caesar salad. It's actually not a bad helping for $8.99. No, no, $8.99, and the chicken is $10.99. They have a Greek salad with shrimp and regular Greek salad. Uh, then they have a Greek salad with plant-based tuna. What is plant-based tuna? Interesting. Then you got different juices and milks, fruits, fruit cups. They have parfaits, uh, yogurt, oranges, apple slices. There's the tie-dye cheesecake that's exclusive here. Oh, there's the uh, Maribel cupcake. It's cute. I have a 50th celebration cheesecake. And we have Pop Goes Banana Cupcake. That must be exclusive to Pop as well. Cookies and Cream Cupcake. That one's missing the sign, so I don't know what that is. And then they have different bakery items like cupcakes, cookies, danishes, donuts, muffins, croissants, coffee cake. It all looks so good. The kids like cereal. They have different cereal cups. Over here, they have some ice cream. Oh, look at that. They got the Spike the Beast zipper. I guess they must have a lot of them, so they're selling them here. But they got Mickey Premium Bar. Uh, then they have what looks like a fruit bar. So, heading over to the next station, they have bacon, egg, and cheese, bagel sandwiches, egg and cheese, bagel sandwiches. Uh, it might be a kid's meal, scrambled eggs, oatmeal with dried cranberries. And then we have the final station here. This has vanilla pancakes, vanilla pancakes with berry compote, ham and cheese omelet, plant-based Mickey-shaped frittata. Kids meals, they have pancakes and a small pancakes with berry compote. Do they not have like a big breakfast? I'm guessing not. I guess the big breakfast would be at the first station. It's a waffle bounty platter that comes with scrambled eggs, potato barrels, bacon, and sausage. So that would be the normal, like, big bounty platter. But it comes with a waffle instead of the Mickey shape. Well, I wonder if it's a Mickey shaped waffle or not. Interesting. But now we'll go walk around the resort a little, shoot some B-roll, and I'll be back for lunch. Pop after four o'clock. I found it. I picked up a straggler. She was just walking down the side of the road. Yeah. So I grabbed her. So felt, felt sorry. <laughs> I'm having instant regrets. I'm sure. <laughs> but uh, she's gonna go pin trade while I finish up this uh, Pop Century food no. vlog because she has no interest in it unless she's eating something. Yeah. If I'm not getting the food, I don't care about it. <laughs> Wow, it's right around dinner time and there's really not a lot of people here. I guess a lot of people are still at the parks until the rain starts because it's getting a little overcast. So that'll probably flush them out for dinner. But it gives me Aunt Lad. Well, there's nobody in here. But let's see what they got for dinner options. Now I'm guessing this is the same as the lunch options. Oh, there's a lot more, a lot more offerings here. So I'll wait for it to reset and I'll start from the beginning. It looks like they have seven options here at the first stand. So we got the pop pimento burger. It's a bacon pimento cheese cheddar bun, a burger on a brioche bun, a bacon cheddar cheese burger, a cheddar cheese burger, an impossible burger, kids meal, they got chick, uh, cheeseburger and chicken strips. Continuing with the full size meals, I got a grilled chicken sandwich. That sounds good actually. Uh, chicken strip served with fries and a honey barbecued pork sandwich. So they didn't have these out earlier, so they must have made them as the day went on. They have turkey and cheese sandwich and a ham and cheese sandwich. Looks like they're both on wheat bread. A uh, plant-based tuna sandwich. Again, I don't know what plant-based tuna is. If anybody knows, post in the comments below. And then they still have all the different salads that I showed earlier. 
I'm actually gonna buy that banana cheap, uh, cupcake before I leave because I want to try that. Oh, look, they got like a uh, cream oatmeal cookie. That looks delicious, actually. Hmm, I don't know what I want. Maybe I'll get one of each. And they got brownies. They weren't here earlier. Yeah, that cookie looks really good. I'm gonna probably get one of those as well. Jeremy's been on a cookie, cookie kick lately. All right, at the second station, they got a chicken farm pasta, a penny pasta with meatballs, a baked ganache turkey bol knees. I don't, I'm butchering that. Uh, super slice of pepperoni pizza, super slice of cheese pizza, a large pepperoni pizza for $18.99, and a large cheese pizza for $17.99. At the last station, they got a lot of stuff, eight things, roasted, Buttermilk chicken served with mashed potatoes and green beans. Braised beef with mashed potato green beans with a, a, a red wine demi glaze. Seared salmon. I'm gonna have to get back to that. So the seared salmon comes with roast potatoes, got uh, green beans, and lemon herb butter. Walt Disney's favorite chili in a bread bowl. Party meat chili inspired by Walt Disney's favorite chili. Then they got a Walt, uh, Walt's chili cheese, all beef with hot long, long hot dog. A Greek plant-based tuna salad, a Greek salad with roasted red pepper hummus, and shrimp and grits. So they have some unique options here as far as this last station that you won't find at other resorts. Definitely a lot more options here for lunch and dinner than there was for breakfast. Breakfast is kind of run of the mill. Dinner, a lot of really interesting options here at Disney's Pop Century. All right, so I got dessert for the two, for the cupcake and the cookie was $12 basically. So we have dessert. We're doing Publix uh, wings for dinner. So this would be a nice little dessert to go with dinner. Actually, picking you up is going to come in handy because I'm terrible at the outro. Oh. <laughs> but that's going to do it for our little Pop Century uh, menu. At dinner, they actually have a lot of different options. We should look at the camera. Oh, I'd rather look at you. You're beautiful. Whatever. Anyway. If you guys like these videos, please click that subscribe button, tap the like, and ring that notification bell so you always know when a new video is headed your way. Thank, Thank you, you so, so much, much for watching. And, and now, now we're on, on to the, the next adventure. adventure. Bye, guys. Bye, guys. Today's video brought to you by Orlando for Families. For amazing prices and even better customer service on all of your stroller rental needs for your Orlando vacation, visit them at the website listed below, www.orlandoforfamilies.com. Use the promo code OHANA to save 15% off of their already competitive prices.